Alright, and welcome back to the Taco Man playthrough. Now that we've defeated need the first boss, we have all eight stages to choose from. And we're gonna start with That's great. I like that fat one in the bottom left. I see you have oh. chosen that one. You chose poorly. How can you want to be in here? Look at this. What the hell is Look at that bloom! Four directional laser. Oh right, I recall that. So our first now. room here is a kill room. We just have to murder the hell out of everything in it. What's it? Uh, not exactly everything. For we the just mayonnaise. have to kill a certain amount of stuff. Except for the milk we bottle. We could spare the mayonnaise, but we decided not to. It dropped the health, and we ignored it. Yeah. Protractor. We also have a bag of bottle of uh, soy sauce. Teriyaki sauce. All right. One of those. Teriyaki also, uh, uh, the economy size soy sauce. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Isn't economy size Whoa. supposed to be the small one? Low sodium. Low sodium. Well, it's economy in the same way <laughs> that, like, the large size of the family pack. Oh, okay. The draws have a so oh, close. Man. Family of what? Giants? <laughs> man, I'm allergic to soy sauce and it is freaking hair. Yeah, whenever it jumps, it shoots little balls out. Touch them and they hurt you. Alright. Can uh, I have a disclaimer? I'm only in here because I'm drunk. Thank you. Was that Tupperware? I think it was like a lunchbox. But pretty close. Alright, so armless Yukari is destroying more mustard bottles. Alright. Yes, also, uh, anything electrical is, uh, hyper deadly. I have a you question. Touch it or you will explode. Is she killing the condiments kill? because she cannot handle them? Because she does not have arms. Um, well, they're shooting lasers at her, so it's really more of a question of self defense. Self defense. Ah, uh, empty to you, Huma. It's the best. The castle wall. Back there at the bottom of that pit was a electrical thing. It's not actually a pit. If you fall down there, you will die before you even fall off the screen. Those are traps. If you touch those lunch boxes back there, you're going to die. Oh, okay. Sometimes it looks like someone's playing a game of Geometry Wars on top of this game. Actually, that's what I've been doing the whole time. That is what bullet hell looks like. Yep. Is this a double it's LP? Geom and now we will, if you can look in our IQ bins in the bottom right corner, you'll see how the, the maximum level is. It's oh, well, Tabasco. Yeah, what's, what do you have against Tabasco? What in the shit? Oh, God. <laughs> uh, Here's our first boss, Shrimp. Uh, Eat me at Golden Corral. I'm just trying to find the sea. Considering what this character is supposed to be based off of, all the lightning makes sense, but everything else, not so much. So yeah, we have two attacks here in our first phase. She has three. We have a homing. We have a big shot, and that comes with a homing shot. Did you know I am Not a sparkles? <laughs> and that a crustacean and, is an arthropod. Uh, I'm sorry. Like were you frightened of this boss? No, because I was too busy frying it. All right. Even though that boss is so big, and you look so shrimpy in comparison. Third Did phase, you know that, you have to get to that shrimp are of the same uh, kind of animals. And now it as changes lobsters? to this, where it just starts dropping bombs. Everywhere. Do you like my tempura jacket? But at this point, if you're good enough, you can kill that was it. Fast. Oh yeah. All right. You're not supposed well. to eat the tail of the shrimp. I'm gonna shoot Kari B. That was Flying bad. Iku. Okay. Yeah, well, do we it got again. the stomp out of it. Hooray. Do it again. B for boo. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Next time, squid.